So, it's early, but I think it's time for a proper hunt. So let's go. Nope, target number one. Let's see what they got. All the Star Wars pops. Looks like they're still giving Game of Thrones a try. I don't even think I want to play with this today. Here are Chuck Norris boxes, Star Wars. Another target. They got anything? We'll see. Can't do chrome, can't do it. Cast away. I got the Avengers shirts. Let's see. Die Hard Christmas. Blah. Chuck Norris. Britney. What was this? That's actually pretty cool. Olaf. Olaf. This is the one that was $20 or $40 or something. Purple Chrome. I wonder what's in the box. Michael 
Bills have the DIY pops. back tired that's a lot of targets there's a lot of walmart a lot of walking around a lot of everything i didn't pick up much i didn't see much i didn't nothing i needed there was a lot of it seemed to be all the targets down south were getting visited by corporate so they had everything in mint mint order i've never seen the funko aisles so neat and compact ever um couldn't find anything i did ask for some things they said they had it in stock but then they were like oh black friday happened so we don't have anything so i did pick up the yoda t-shirt um i really wanted baby yoda but this will do for now because they're talking about baby yoda won't happen until may or september um it's a pretty cool shirt. So it's just, you know, regular sort of cereal box. When I saw it, I was like, I don't want cereal. Um, but then when I shook it, it's just a t-shirt. So I'm kind of happy about it. So it's kind of cool. I really don't want you in it. Oh, wow. I don't think I want to hurt the box. So it really is just like a cereal box. You can close it back up. It's actually, Pretty cool. So the shirt's pretty simple. Pretty cool shirt. Not bad. Like I'm glad I picked this one up. They have, uh, as you saw in the video, they had two others. They had Boba Fett and um, Stormtroopers. We also got a box. Came home to a box. Um, it says Dragon Den Collectibles. I don't know the store, but I think this is what I ordered off Macari. If so, I'm glad it's here. It, it, uh, I've been trying to collect a lot of Freddy's as much as I can. Um, I have about one, two, three, four, six of them. Uh, trying to find the ones that are reasonable price because I'm not trying to break the bank on a pop. As much as I like pops, I'm not trying to break the bank. That's why I'm also really happy to go to the Funko HQ in March when I go to ECC. Um, I'm going to ECC Thursday, Friday, I'm going to be spending the majority of the day at HQ, depending on how long it takes, and then back to Emerald City Comic Con on Saturday. I'm trying to split it up. I, a con is, is intense. I don't think this is as, as crazy as New York City Comic Con or San Diego Comic Con, uh, but it's, you know, it's the first con of the season gets busy so I'm splitting it up between like two days but bracing myself so I can at least get some Funko HQ. Uh, so I got the 2018 Fun Days. Back of the box says Fun Days 2018. Friend of the box says 5,000 piece limited edition 2018 San Diego Comic Con exclusive. It's the Dumb and Dumber um, in the tuxedo from the movie. Dumb and Dumber is another one of my favorite movies. Uh, so the fact that they made Freddy with the tux on, had to get it. So I'm just sort of confused. I guess, I mean, because my fun day pops that I got from this year didn't have a San Diego Comic Con sticker on it. So I'm not sure about this, but who knows? Another one added to the collection. Pretty excited. It's a quick video. It was um, not much bought, a lot to look at, nothing needed. 
Um, I, I am happy I picked up the Yoda shirt. Um, and this guy came in. Uh, I'm still trying to figure out where I ordered something from Entertainment Earth and it's coming snail mail from California, so we'll see. We interrupt this video for a very special mail call. My tummy! Didn't think it was gonna come yet. It said it was still in California, but gotta love the tracking. You wanna open side? That's just paper. Ooh. Ready? The Great Ape Goku Entertainment Exclusive Pop. The only problem here with this is this wasn't Dragon Ball Z. He turned into a Great Ape in Dragon Ball. So this should be part of the Dragon Ball line. But, you know, well, I guess we all can't true and picky and choosy. So. So that's it. So, uh, back to a regular scheduled video. As always, hit that subscribe button, smash that like button. Funko Dad's out.